From the outside looking in, this is a cookout just like any other. But Jessica Hulick from Moms Demand Action says this ain't just a cookout. This is a celebration of the lives that we still have to, li to live and, and, and we're honoring the people that we've lost. So um, that's why we're out here today. Hulick is talking about Parkland, Santa Fe, and going all the way back to Sandy Hook and all the others. Everyone here is wearing orange. We wear orange because that's the color that hunters wear so that they um, people know that they're human and do not shoot them. And so that's become the color of um, gun violence prevention. Others wear their support for sensible gun control. Depending on who you ask, sensible gun laws may just be the viable solution to this problem. Right, but there are others who say sensible gun laws, again depending on the definition, can infringe on our Second Amendment rights. The two Republican senators from North Carolina agree, in a way. Senator Tom Tillis recently said, in part, we need to talk about background checks, we need to talk about bump stocks, we need to talk about a number of other things that I think reasonable people are prepared to take action on in Congress. Senator Burr recently said there are areas of great common agreement that we can find. Bump stocks are certainly one of them, age and background checks as well. There are 450 gatherings like this going on across the country today. The students are being heard, moms are being heard. We are not going to stop until it changes, so that's what will make it change. For some, change is not needed. For others, change can't come soon enough. And for a select few, change is too little, too late. In Durham, ABC 11, Eyewitness News.